Today we're going to be looking at the legendary career of Tupac Shakur. Tupac Amaru Shakur was born in East Harlem, New York on June 16, 1971. He was raised by a single mother and he attended the Paul Lawrence Dunbar High School up until 1984. Following that year, his family relocated to San Francisco, and this is where he found his passion for rapping. He got his first opportunity by Shock G and Digital Underground, who gave him eight bars in the song Same Song. But Tupac wanted to be more solo and independent from the group. So then in 1991, he dropped his debut solo album called Tupac Loves Now, with help of Shock G on the main track being the legendary Brenda's Got a Baby. Also in the same year, Tupac appeared in his first movie called Nothing But Trouble. Tupac was making a big name for himself around this time and was becoming very successful. And when there's success, not everyone is happy about that. In late 1991, Tupac was beaten brutally by two Oakland police officers. Tupac's stepbrother commented on this incident. He said it seemed like it got worse when Tupac got more success. Tupac sued the Oakland Police Department for $10 million for a false arrest and imprisonment. However, this lawsuit was only settled for $42,000. This wasn't the only interaction that Tupac had with the police. Another incident occurred on Halloween in 1993 when Tupac was arrested after shooting two off-duty police officers. And during this trial, both officers admitted that they were carrying stolen guns and the judge also deemed that they were outside their jurisdiction and they were found to be intoxicated. However, the officers were found guilty of lying about whether Shakur was the aggressor or not. The jury discovered that Tupac Shakur was merely trying to protect the citizen the motorcyclist who was being assaulted by two armed men and they only pulled out a gun once the two officers had done the same. And this is very much an infamous moment in Tupac's life that he shot two off-duty police officers protecting another man. In 1993, it would also be the same year that Tupac released his second album, Strictly for My N-I-G-G-A-Z. And the main track for that album was the legendary track called Keep Your Head Up. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to comment, leave a like, and subscribe. Hit that bell notification. Peace.